In this video, I'll show you how you can connect your Calendly calendar to system.io and how you can put your calendar on a system.io funnel. So first, what we need to do once we've logged into system.io, you want to go to funnels and then choose the funnel you want to add the calendar to. So I'll just choose this random one. And if we go to view funnel, you'll see here I've made room for the, for the calendar already. So I'm going to add my calendar here. Now I've made room. So if you go to edit page, and you'll need to do this later anyway, so go to edit page and make sure you've got room here to add your calendar. I'm going to add my calendar here. So now what you need to do is go over to Calendly and log in. I'm just going to go ahead and create a brand new account for this video. So I'll go to get started and create an account. Okay, so once you've logged into Calendly, you're then going to see your meeting. This will be the default one that you've created once you've created your account. If you want to create a new meeting, you can go to create and then choose something here. So a one-off meeting and you can share here whatever times you're available to work and create your meeting window. But once you've got this meeting here, you want to go ahead and click on share and we can copy link. Now we're copying the link to this Calendly calendar, which will say what days I'm available to have a 30 minute meeting. So now we want to go ahead and go back to the squeeze page. So go to the system.io editor and what you want to do is you want to scroll down and you want to find raw HTML. So go ahead and drag that wherever you want to add your calendar. So I'm going to add it here. So now we've got the raw HTML added. So now click on raw HTML, then go to edit code. And what you need to do here is type in the raw HTML code of your calendar. So go back to Calendly, go ahead and click on share, then go to add to website. Go inline embed, continue, and here you've got your embed code. So go ahead and copy this, and you can customize these colors here, which it lets you customize. But once you've got the HTML code copied, go ahead and go to system.io, and you just then want to go ahead and paste it in. Click save, and now this should be working. So let's save these changes and preview it. And there you go. When we've previewed it, we can now see we've got a calendar added Bradley Harrison 30 minute meeting and you can go ahead and book that meeting whenever. So I hope that video helped you out in adding Cal Calendly to system.io.